All right. Here's where we just start opening up box after box and looking for bottles to take. Told you I was a scavenger. I mean, I'm not like to the bone a scavenger. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna scavenge every little room for every corner, but I mean, if I see something like this, there's just tons of crates of bottles in them. I'm gonna take the time to stop and and check a bunch of them and just kind of uh, speed check them like I'm doing now and just collect them. Cause it's definitely it's definitely not a not a bad thing to do. You can get some up here as well. You can find some on the on the floor here and just kind of kind of pick them up as you as you walk along. But you can get to the higher to like the way up high bottles. That would be up here. That was totally not even worth it. A lot more of these seem empty on the second run through here than I remember. Whatever. Ah, yeah, these definitely seem a little bit more empty than they than they were at an earlier time and date. Yeah, now I'm over encumbered, so I'll just probably end up giving Rex a bunch of them. Oh, sweet, there's like a bottle cap, I think. Is that a bottle cap? No, it's just a thing of blood. Thought I was seeing a bottle cap. Whoops. Rex is incapable of range attacks and will continue to use melee. Alright. It will be under miscellaneous and it will be under E, I'm sure. Here you go. There's 111 there. Let's keep... Let's keep taking these. Stop barking. Alright. Just gonna keep opening these guys up, looking for more bottles. Just speedily going through it all. You know, it might look like a waste of time, but you're you're gonna end up with a a decent handful of caps by the end of it if you just keep up and uh, and do it all. I guarantee you, it's not gonna be like well worth it, but it'll be worth it enough. You know, you'll get 400, 500 caps out of it if you end up taking enough bottles. Since a lot of these were knocked down when the robot flew up and went crazy. gonna keep uh, keep looking for bottles here told you this would be a little bit annoying but I would like the money where's Rex Rex I'm going to give you more more of these crappy empty bottles that everyone's probably like what the hell are you doing oh damn it I need you to carry the most that you can can you carry like three more two more no you can't even carry two more how about one Aw. all right now I'm probably just gonna cap myself out mostly, and uh, and then we'll we'll uh, the bottle the bottle making the the bottle cap making machine is in this room that we have to get rid of, so it's easy. However, I probably am going to uh, doop, 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 doop. probably I'm gonna explore the rest of this area. It's like it's like right over here. I think this is it. Yeah, here you go. Strip the important parts. We got three scrap metals. And uh, we can head through this. I think there's some more stuff to loot. Fresh apple. There's a fridge full of stuff, too. Let's we'll keep moving on. Fission batteries. More bottles, which I'm going to be taking. I mean, normally I wouldn't do stuff like this, but, I mean, there's just a ton of them, and they're pretty easy to get. Come on, Rex. There you go. I mean, they're, they're pretty easy to get. All you need to do is go into the boxes and, and take them all out. I don't really care what's in here. What's going on in here? A collapsed room. Empty bottle. There's just sarsaparilla bottles like freaking everywhere. I mean, it makes sense. We are in a sarsaparilla plant. Good 
die. There's like more in here. I, mean, I don't know if these are all empty. Nope, they are not all empty. So I will, uh... I'll go ahead and, and start robbing these. <laughs> I'm sure this is pretty annoying. But, you know... Oh, there we go. I'll probably go ahead and, uh... And use some aid. And the Brahmin steak. Yes, it is all going dark. I will take the flamer fuel. Um, don't really know if there's much else in here. I'm just gonna keep taking the flamer fuel. I'll sell all the flamer fuel. Yeah, just shoot at me, not the dog. Why not? But uh, all right, sweet. Let's let's make our way out of here. Oh shit. I'm always a sucker for a vending machine. Now I'm over encumbered. No! I don't even know if there's anything I can... Nope, there really isn't. I guess I can just get rid of some... aid. I'm over by three pounds. Awesome. Well, that didn't do as much as I'd hoped. Um... Sure, let's see if we can get back. I'm not even gonna open this up and do the same thing. I'm just gonna try and try and head out as quick as I can. Get to uh, get to the gun runners and sell stuff, and then go talk to McLaffrey. I think her name is something like that. It's something along those lines. Just fast travel. We'll fast travel to the gun runners first and sell. So you should be able to see just how many how many caps I'll make from all the bottles I got. It should be around three to five hundred, which isn't bad at all for the amount of time I spent doing that. It's a pretty decent boost in caps, and plus I kind of need it now after spending like seven or eight thousand caps on uh on all that stuff. I mean that's 195 caps right there plus whatever I've got on me. Welcome, sir. So let's go ahead and sell it all. Go ahead and hit this up. Let's see. Got three fission batteries from that. 270 caps from the bottle. So the time spent doing that wasn't so bad for what we ended up getting out of it. I'm sure I can sell... Uh... Oh, shit, I need to go to ammo. All this flamer fuel, all these energy cells... I think that's probably about it. So now I have an another 751 caps to work with. Um, don't think I'm going to have enough for what I wanted. Single shot, no. This guy has a lever action shotgun. And uh, I actually want to buy it, but it's like 2,000 so yeah, it's, I'm not going to have I'm not going to have that much for, for a little bit. Guy's just running. So let's go turn it the Crimson Caravan and that'll that'll probably end this little this little section up. It'll probably end our little extravaganza of this twenty minutes and hopefully everything turns out well. Hopefully I don't lose the fucking footage again through some stupid thing. Cause I was actually probably about I don't know, forty minutes to an hour past this point that we're at now so that kinda sucks. I actually made it into Vault 3 and I was doing a lot of stuff and turned out really good I felt strong about it etc etc and now it's just I've got nothing I have to get rid of like all of it which really sucks so I'll be doing it again I know I've said that a lot through this playthrough but Shit just keeps happening. Slightly annoying. There she is. Welcome back. Good. I'm sure you were thorough. Here's your payment for a job well done. And I think she gives us like 500. I believe yeah, 500. There you go. So her quest line is done. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that quest line is done. Now, what do we have left for quests? Nothing but a hound dog deck. Look. 
Yep, so pretty much what I'd want to do now is go to the world map, mark that, and uh, definitely, definitely head back to that. So, I'm out of time for right now. When we come back, I will definitely be at probably near Vault 3. I'll probably start up. I'll probably take some of the walking out so you don't have to see it, but hopefully this 20 minutes is, is good to go. Um, maybe depending on what my other footage oh no, no, that footage isn't usable either. Oh, yeah, both of them kind of screwed up, so. Um, I will definitely be back and we'll, we'll go do some Vault 3 stuff.